Hello everybody and welcome back to Drumard Farm. All full of busy. The first fields are coming through. One or two spotty patches. And I have canola up there on field three. Now in the mid spring so we can get some barley in. On Kieran FS's modded T7. We've gone all Irish. Speaking of going all Irish, we have the man that farms here in real life in Team Speak, Mr. Noel Burn. Burn. Hello, everybody. You have to speak up, Noel. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I did say in a previous episode that um, this T7 with the Scottish flag didn't really fit. Which was a very kind donation to the channel by Kieran. But it was missing that Irish flag. Awesome. Right, we're going to put barley into this field. So we'll lower it and Hire a worker. There you go, Noel, you can drive that. <laughs> cool. Right, <laughs> elsewhere we've got the Sammy is going to be spreading slurry on those grass fields. The good stuff, as Noel would say. <laughs> And the mighty T7315, is it 315? I think so. Cultivating here up on field 9. I did say that we wanted a crop of soybeans in this field before we turned it over to grass. So we're preparing the land. Now then, money's tight. 13,000 in the bank and dropping. Because we're paying all these workers to do our jobs for us. <laughs> I do not work for free. Yeah, I know you don't work for free. You've cost me a bloody fortune. <laughs> <laughs> um, down at the shop, the New Holland T6. I've got a load of milk. 22,000 litres. Hopefully this will bring us a pretty penny. Back it up into here, where I have the placeable milk trigger. I'm burning the bloody clutch out again. <laughs> and how the hell do we empty this? Oh, there we go. Money's rolling in now. Now, and while that's filling up, we'll have a look over the fence at the shop. And we've got some new pallet forks. Oh, dodgy camera work. And some pig food, potatoes and corn. All because that's the only thing the animals are missing. You can see productivity is at 50% for 72 pigs. Bloody hell, they're breeding like rabbits. But they are missing corn and potatoes. So we're going to go and pick them up and run them up to the arable farm. And guess what, No, I didn't make enough money off the milk to purchase that seed that we want. At least I don't think we did. Let's have a quick look. Ah, we did, just. <gasps> it's the Cavernland Optima 5, Optima V, and it's 29,000 euros. I've only got 29,500 in the bank. I need it for sunflowers and maize and sugar beet. We do have the cheaper option of the Amazon at 13, but it is only 3 meters working width. The Optima V is 4.5 meters. 
What the hell? I had to break the bank. Bye. Money doesn't last long with me. <laughs> <laughs> I bet Noel doesn't spend money like me in real life. Bloody hell. You wouldn't be farming very much for very long. You spend more money than you give it in. Oh, you're damn right. I'm good at spending money. <laughs> I don't know about making money. <laughs> you listen to that. In fact, am I carrying any message? <laughs> am I carrying any eggs? I'll go and find out and see if I can sell any eggs. Every penny counts now. <laughs> yes, we are. 194 euros. <laughs> it might keep Noel busy in the field on course play for a while. <laughs> At least he'll keep working and cultivating that field up for us. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go and sell a few pigs I think just to make some money back. Right, I think I'm gonna have to leave the water tank here and the shop and come back for it at a later date. In fact that could be really cheap and get the shop to deliver it. I.e. Reset point. Reset the tank. Boom. Damn good shop this place. Delivers it instantly. <laughs> And you know what it is? I've just purchased this new cedar and I don't have enough money in the account to actually fill the bugger with seed. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to have to wait and see how much money Noel spends. Another message! God, I'm popular tonight. Uh, let's see how much money Noel spends cultivating that field and see if we'll get any left over I do missing bits as well you better not be missing bits I need a good harvest this year <laughs> <laughs> right this might be a bit dangerous but I'm trying to take two pallets of potatoes up the main road, so we better have some flashy lights on. <laughs> In fact, we better have some hazard warning lights on. <laughs> Be aware, Shawnee Bay is on the road. Oh, no, 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 no. We nearly had an accident. We are safe. I haven't got a bloody clue where we're going, because I can't see. Oh, oh, oh no, I've just hit a white pickup. He's tooting his horn at us and flashing the lights. Holy <laughs> crap. I'm going to have to come out of the car because I'm panicking that I'm going to lose these pallets off the blooming forks on the front. I know you wouldn't see this in real life, but it's a game! <laughs> Better take my time going down the bank. Christ, stay on, stay on, stay on. If you're wondering where the pallets come from, it's another fantastic mod from 
Modding Central. Um, can't quite remember the name, but you can see just by a search in their downloads page. Um, you get pig food pallets and I think you get dairy food pallets as well. Uh, for pallets for the cows, that's what I'm trying to say now. <laughs> Right, do we need to... Oh no, it's empty. Ah, oh, good stuff. That should be then full. Uh, where's the animals page gone? Yeah! So now I just need to get down to the shop and bring up some corn. Awesome! And we now have 73 pigs. Bloody hell, they are breeding. Right, I can leave the pallet here. Can I? They won't come off the forks. Get off! Come on. Get off, man. Now the clutch is overheating. <laughs> new clutch then? Yeah, new clutch. Oh, flaming hell. Get off. Okay, we're not leaving the pallets there because they won't get off the bloody forks. Where else can I leave them? Up here by the tyre. Get off, man! I'm gonna have a hissy fit in a minute. Get off, you stupid bloody things. It's because they're not actually attached to the pallet forks properly. I've got the pallet forks stuck underneath. Desperately trying to shake them off here. <laughs> Get off. Have you tried to them? You know what it is? I might even be able to pick them up. No, I can't even pick them up. Because they're still attached to the forks. This is where they drop off. I've got them balanced just on the end here. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! They're off, Noel! We're free at last! Dear me. And I desperately need fuel in this T6. Right, I'm going to put this cedar into the shed. quickly zip around the other side of the building and get some fuel in here I wonder if we have any milk left in the tank down at the dairy farm I'll just check that while it's fueling up uh, milk tank 9000 litres, oh, we'll, we'll be able to make some more money And Noel's nearly finished cultivating. Cool. Very good. And Noel number two, <laughs> helper I, is now a girl. <laughs> is probably going to have enough seeds to finish this field off. Awesome.
Brilliant. Right, let's see about getting some of this lovely slurry on the field. Love this, Sammy. Did you ever get this Sammy downloaded? Uh, no. I, I have it downloaded, but I have not used it. I haven't got it activated. It's brilliant with the gearbox add-on. Right, can we back up? Around the end of the silage pit? Of course we can, man. You'd think I drove a tractor in real life. <laughs> Not for a good few years. Or nothing of this size anyway. My tractor of choice at the minute, in real life, Ford 3000. I'm sure there's a few photographs kicking about on my Facebook page. Anyway guys, we're getting close to the end of the video here. I'm not sure how long I've been recording for. Let's change gear. Yeah, that's it. Good stuff. And I'm going to come out of cab. And if you've liked the video, consider leaving a thumbs up. It will be greatly appreciated. And don't forget, you can always shout a big hello to know. mighty hard worker and as said before he farms this farm in real life the dairy farm thanks to all my subscribers new and old young and old <laughs> welcome <laughs> one and all and I think I'll leave it up to Noel to say goodbye goodbye and thank you for watching good lad Noel and I'm Shawnee B Bye for now. <laughs>